there is a certain magic about childhood love in dramas. It displays the pure love stories and the strong emotional backstories with the main leads. The sweet interactions and playful journey is like a bonus to it. Finding out how the leads get to know each other and their relationship in the past is such a bliss. They ultimately realize that the other person is the one who has been right there and will continue to be as more than just a friend. So, here are 10 childhood love Chinese dramas you must watch. First Romance It shows the slow build up in relationships that we all faced when we were young and inexperienced in relationships. Yang Ke and Xiong Yi Fang were schoolmates. But back in her younger days, she never discovered that Yankee was her secret admirer. When they get into university, Yankee come across Xiaonya Fang, who was once his crush, but did not recognize her as she was no longer the tomboy. Xiaonya Fang fell for Yankee at first sight. They approached each other, which leads to various surprising and touching moments. Unrequited Love Liu Ji is willing to stand up for what she feels is right or wrong, even so towards Hua Nan whom she harbors feelings for. Liu Ji has been madly in love with Xiang Hua Nan since they were children, but he has never noticed her. Coincidentally, Liu Ji and Hua Nan attend the same university. She has loved Xuan Hu Nan for 15 years, but she has accepted the fact that her feelings for Hua Nan will remain unrequited forever. Unexpectedly, they seem to get together through destiny getting over misunderstandings and complicated situations. My Fated Boy Lin Yan is 7 years older than Lu Jin Nan. Their parents are best friends and had marriage plans for the two once they get older. Lin Yan has a rough past encounter with love that even the thought of falling for her younger childhood friend made her hesitant. She suddenly comes back into her life, changing her lifestyle. Eventually, she has the courage and takes a chance on love with her friend. They start to fall in love. Love is sweet. Twenty-eight-year-old Jiang Jun is trying to join MH, one of the top investment banks. At MH, Jiang Jun meets her childhood playmate Yuan Shai. As Jiang Jun tries to guide her new career between work and making allies, with the sudden arrival of a new friend from a rival company, Du Lei, Yuan Shai's secret feelings from his youth are rekindled again from Jiang Jun. A lot of bickering between them helped their love story because it showed how they progressed together. Our Secret Ding Xian and her family moved to her childhood place after her father got the job to be a teacher at another school. There she met her childhood friend Zhao Si Yu. Although Zhao Si Yu is a genius, he is not the cold type and Ding Xian is a mediocre who tries her best to pass. But there are times where she fails, yet she gets stronger. She is actually smart, studies hard, and is very determined to prove herself. Ding Xian and Zhao Si Yu are deskmates, who after getting off to a slightly prickly start, soon come close friends who care about each other. Go ahead. Three unrelated children, suffering different injuries in their original families, by chance, get together and become siblings. Eldest brother Lin Xiao, second brother He Ji Chiu, and youngest sister Li Chan Zhao, broken deep from their painful pasts, come together to create a new home, new life, and happiness. The three of them choose to work together. After experiencing some hardships, they bravely walk out of the shadow of the past and make a better version of themselves. Summer Again
Tongshi is a ballerina from a big city and Lin Yan Yi is her childhood sweetheart and secret manga artist. She moves back to her own hometown due to her mother's work. There she meets her childhood friend Lin Yan Yi. However, their initial meeting up isn't good due to the misunderstanding of when they were young. She becomes friends with Tao Zhu, he is her classmate too. He also turns out to be manga artist that she really likes. Flourish in Time Lu Miao gets a brother as Jiang Hao Yu when she was young. Her family takes care of him and they grow up together. Liu Mao is cute and playful, likes to read manga and is not good at studies. Meanwhile, Hao Yu is super serious in his study, smart and popular at school. She has always protected and stood up for her brother when other people make fun of him because of his physical disability. After Shi Yu's arrival, things start to change between them, especially for Hao Yu. Eventually, the brother and sisterly love evolved into young love. The best of you in my mind. Xu Feng had a crush on Lin Shi Yi since they were both at school, but he has never gathered up courage to confess. When they were in university, Lin Shi loses her one month living expense due to a bet over an arm wrestling competition with Xu Feng. Due to this incident, the two become closer to each other. She then gradually realizes her feelings for him too. My girl. Meng Yu is a makeup artist. She lives in painful memories and has a dissociative personality whenever she gets negative thoughts. She has a scar in her face that makes her suffer for years. Shen Yi is the CEO of the beauty company. He wants to find a concealer that would completely conceal scars. They meet through a competition. Shen Yi becomes the reason for Meng Yu's imperfections. He turned his guilt into his driving force to succeed with his career and slowly fell in love with her.